We are at the Stift of Mann für die Deutsche Wissenschaft and Iversity is hosting the second workshop uh, with the MOOC production fellows as well as professors, other professors that are uh, going to host courses on the Iversity platform. Hello, my name is Oliver Janoschka. I work for the Stifterverband für die Deutsche Wissenschaft uh, as a head of programs, uh, which has a new focus on digitalization. And in this context, we have been collaborating with Iversity now on MOOCs. Iversity is an online platform for uh, higher education content. Essentially what we do is we help professors and universities to bring their courses online, to uh, leverage the potential of technology uh, in higher education and to um, yeah, do what can be done best online so that they can focus on what they do best offline. It's really pricey, uh, but some of them are great. I brought one standard graphics tablet over there and one Cintiq, which is a graphics tablet with integrated screen for you to try. Uh, well, actually, you know, I was very skeptic, like many people who don't really know what they're talking about. But then I thought the only way to find out how good can a MOOC be is to do it yourself. Yeah, we are learning to, to make the videos shorter. So the first videos were very long, me explaining in, in, in very detailed. Also, of course, it's much more fun because usually you tend to um, prepare for your courses on your own. Um, in your chamber, in your office, and now it's kind of a group effort. So I wouldn't consider this a threat, but an opportunity, but it, I think it will really require some rethinking on different levels in higher education. As I really think that it's just one way of educating people and one way of teaching, um, I would never say it's like um, we'll be there to replace higher education in any other sense. And I would say one would have to rethink the traditional role in the classroom. I don't think that MOOCs can really replace any personal interaction with a professor. But you know, the ideas like flipped or inverted classroom would really give more opportunity for discussion. So I think there are lots, there are lots of things that students can explore by themselves that do not necessarily have to be taught in a classroom. A new thing which can be used in addition to traditional university courses. And I think perhaps the future will be to merge both. Um, furthermore, we know as a private institution that there are many talented students out there who have no access to, let's say, a Western European education or, you know, not to any university at all. During my studies I realized that you know, given the transformative potential of technology, um, I feel there's so much that could be, do, be done in higher education uh, using all this uh, technology that's become available to us, all the social networking, uh, online video, all these things. So maybe we can manage um, just to get a broader audience and uh, get people interested in the topic. I think we all had great experience at this workshop. Uh, we brought together professors from all sorts of different disciplines, from different countries even, and uh, it was a great experience for all of us. We practiced what we preach. There's a lot of peer-to-peer -peer learning going on, uh, people giving each other feedback. We learned a lot ourselves uh, about what you know the professors need uh, to provide a great learning experience, and I'm very much looking forward to going live in the fall.